Welcome back once again. In this part, we will set our data to our update data layout. So for doing this, first we need to create and we can comment out data item and in here we need to data item value and we, in here we need to add some variable so private string type private string node private string private integer amount and so this three field now inside this on view holder method we need to set our data so type is equal to model dot get type so this way our data will store inside this type variable and not is equal to model dot get note and amount is equal to model dot get amount so we we declare this variable as globally and create another variable so string post key and we need to generate our post key so post key is equal to get reference position dot get key make sure that we added all this string variable globally because later we will need to add this variable on other method so now open this update data item method and in here we need to set our data to edit text so how can we do it so edit type dot set text is going to be our type where we that we store our data from our model class and this edit type and not edit type and those edit type dot set selection type dot length and this way we will get our data at the at the end of our text so now edit not dot set text is going to be our note and for note it we need to also add set selection and note dot length and dot edit amount dot set text and this amount and we need to convert it to string so string dot value of amount and now we can set it set selection string dot and we already converted it so we need to add set selection string dot value of amount and dot length so we add this variable and we set it to our edit text data so edit type is our edit text data and now open this income and open up this income data and now if we click any item and click on and then we can see our amount our type and our node is added inside our alert dialog custom alert dialog input field so that i want to show you so now if we want to update then we can add our data and then we need to click this update button but we did not add this functionality yet maybe in our next part we will do it so that is the basic part and if you if you notice and you can see our our cursor at the end of our text and this is by this this is happen and just because of we added this set selection to length okay so now we can click but if we click on expense data it will not work because we did not add it in here so that's it for this